So right now I am with Rachel Manning, who is a master's student in fishery science at the University of Washington and is doing some pretty cool research in partnership with the Smithsonian to discover all kinds of new fish, right? Yes. So how do you do this? So um, we have been going down in two different manned submersibles in the Caribbean across five different locations. These two manned submersibles are the only subs in the world that have these fish collection devices. We spray out this anesthetic onto a fish that we want to catch. It puts the fish to sleep. The fish si kind of starts floating on its side and then we actually have this giant vacuum cleaner basically attached to the outside of the sub and we suck that fish up, put it in a little holding tank, take it up to the surface and when we get up to the surface these fish are actually still alive so we can see their in life coloration. We can pick up this guy and you can see he's really teeny tiny. Most of these um, that I'm describing are about 9 to 20 millimeters long so very very small. I have to look at them through this microscope and make all sorts of counts on them. So now we are in like the fish species library. This is Catherine Maslinikov and you manage this jar Disney World <laughs> full of fish, right? So we have 12 million specimens here in the fish collection. Uh, some of them date back as long as 1862. This is where we keep all the fish that are too big to fit in jars. This is the deep sea angler fish. It has um, bioluminescent bacteria, so it glows in the dark. So now bringing in more tropical species allows us to really have a way of exploring other parts of uh, fish diversity, understanding ecology, and, and understanding change. So climate change is happening, oceans are warming, we know this, we see it happening. So what is that gonna mean? How are we gonna know what's gonna happen to those species? So Rachel, how do you feel participating in this research, going out and discovering fish that have never been discovered before? It's awesome, it's the coolest thing ever. Very cool for you and also a cool opportunity too to learn more tomorrow from two to five. The School of Fisheries is having an open house. Yes. So any fish enthusiasts are welcome to join. I'm Allison Morrow at the University of Washington, King 5 News.